Until early high school, I lived in a city called Dunblane in Scotland, and in 1996, um, a gunman shot and killed 16 children and one teacher in a primary school there. Um, I've been thinking a lot about that in light of what happened in Texas yesterday. Um, I live and work in America. I'm not American, but I love it here. But some things are confusing to me, and it's confusing to me that some people, pol some politicians, are more keen to protect the Second Amendment and the interests of the gun lobby than to protect the people they're supposed to be serving. Um, I was just a kid when the attack in Dumbling happened. I didn't go to the primary school where it occurred, but I remember it, and I remember what happened afterwards. Britain changed their gun control laws. Um, I think it's easy to see that more than one issue can be a play at once. It is a mental health issue, and it's somewhere on a scale from ironic to disgustingly hypocritical that Donald Trump is talking about mental health with regards to this attack, when his administration has done nothing but try to restrict access to healthcare for people who need it the most, but it's also about gun control. Um, you can't stop everything bad from happening in the world, you can't take away people's impulse to do things like this, but you can restrict their access to resources that would allow them to murder on a much bigger scale. Um, Mike Pence is among one of many Republicans who take thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars from the NRA every single year and he wants to talk about prayers and religion and being a good Christian. Um, my thoughts and sadness and outrage are 100% with the people who lost loved ones yesterday and in all these other horrific attacks but prayers are not what stopped more atrocities like Dunblane from happening in the United Kingdom. Gun control did.